16th day people in Milwaukee protest the death of George Floyd at the hands of Minneapolis police. This group marched from Mitchell Park across the 16th Street Viaduct to City Hall. It's a historic route used by civil rights marchers in the late 1960s. Today, they called for the establishment of a Civilian Police Accountability Council in Milwaukee. It would replace the Fire and Police Commission with a democratically elected civilian police council. So people from the community. Um, and essentially what we want is community control of the police. At Milwaukee City Hall, members of Youth Rising Up left chalk messages on the sidewalk calling for justice. <laughs> Demonstrators also turned out in Muskego today. They held signs along Janesville Road in front of Coles with the message, Black Lives Matter. I have a granddaughter who um, is half black and half white and she, she's got anxiety. She's afraid of being in school at times. She's, she's fearful. She's been called names. They live in St. Louis. There's, there's things going on down there. Um, and a third grader shouldn't have anxiety about being in school. The Muskego Democratic Action Team and the Waukesha County Democratic Party organized the protest. Two men with a Trump 2020 flag stood nearby. And a group of seniors staged a sit-in protest at MLK and North this afternoon. They said they may not be up to marching across town, but still want their voices heard. We don't want to have any question about whether we support these young people or not. So we're coming out to have a sit down to stand up for what our young people are doing.